Today, we will talk about Gresham's Law, Definition, Effects, and Example. Gresham's Law states that bad money drives out good and can be applied to the currency markets. The law stemmed from the historical use of precious metals to manufacture coins and their subsequent value. Since the abandonment of metallic currency standards, the theory often describes the stability and movement of different currencies in global markets. Sir Thomas Gresham lived from 1519 to 1579 and wrote about the value and minting of coins while working as a financier and later founded the Royal Exchange of the City of London. When Henry VIII changed the composition of the English shilling, replacing a substantial portion of the silver with base metals, citizens separated the English shilling coins and hoarded the coins containing more silver which were worth more than their face value. Historically, mints manufactured coins from gold, silver, and other precious metals, which gave the coins their value. Issuers of coins sometimes lowered the level of the precious metals used and passed the coins as full-value coins. New coins with less metal content had less market value and traded at a discount. The old coins retained a higher value. Gresham's law is evident in a modern economy with legal tender laws. When all currency units are legally mandated to be recognized at the same face value, the traditional version of Gresham's law operates. In the absence of effectively enforced legal tender laws, Gresham's law operates in reverse as good money drives bad money out of circulation. In 1982, the U.S. government changed the composition of the penny to contain 97.5% zinc. This change made pre-1982 pennies worth more than their post-1982 counterparts, while the face value remained the same. Due to the debasement of the currency and resulting inflation, copper prices rose from an average of $0.6662 per pound in 1982 to $3.0597 per pound in 2006 with the purchasing power of a penny falling by nearly 80%. Here are four key takeaways. 1. Sir Thomas Gresham lived from 1519 to 1579 and wrote about the value and minting of coins while working as a financier. 2. Gresham's law is a principle that states that bad money drives out good. 3. The law observes that legally overvalued currency will drive legally undervalued currency out of circulation. 4. The law observes the effects of currency debasement. Hope this would help. Thanks for watching.